Hi, Jane. Hi, Franklin. Um, I just wanted to sort of review your interlocking band. Originally, when you saw it, when you're here, I used five larger diamonds uh, just as a prototype. Um, now, using the larger ones that you have that sort of match, I have five uh, in the center with one little bit smaller one that I can tuck in right there. It may go a little bit past your ring, but I just think it completes it uh, by adding that um, six and seven on the side there uh, to fill it out. So I think it'll be really sweet. We could come down further with some smaller ones, but your diamonds are bigger, so they won't really fit in there. I'd have to widen, widen that. And I think this will really make a nice complement to it. Um, I sent you some still photographs of this, but I may as well just talk to you about it a little bit. Laying this out, using a larger, I picked the nicer of the sapphires uh, in the center here uh, to do a pendant that's similar to your earrings. Here we'd be using a little bit larger ones on top and bottom, and then trying to match seven on each side here, um, where we'd have 14, just a touch smaller, and then 10 of those, and then some in the bale. So that's a nice layout, because we had these two bigger diamonds um, available, and I think that would work quite nice to match. If you wanted to experiment and do something a little funky, this would be cool too, where I'd use both the sapphires, both the large diamonds, create sort of this um, more of a diamond shape. I could set it up in a square and put the bale over here as well, but I just thought that was pretty neat with doing some little diamonds here. The trouble when we start to expand it larger is I don't have matching diamonds all the way around. They, all your diamonds, although you have a lot of them, they all vary in size a little bit. And I'm not sure how I would work them in. It's best when you're doing these borders if they all match perfectly and they don't. Even on the other design, I have to put different sizes on top and bottom uh, versus the sides. And then if you really wanted to elongate it, uh, it gets out to um, a little bit longer using the other sapphire in there, extends it a little bit the two bigger diamonds and again I'd use the same five top and bottom like I did in the other one because the width doesn't change but the length here again I'm, I don't know how I'm going to match in all these diamonds I'm going to have to just sort of fit them in um, some smaller ones and larger ones and um, to sort of blend it um, and then the same thing in the in the bale there so that's sort of a a review of those and then I will um, also send the still photographs for you to um, review. Thanks.